Jayla Torrance. Welcome to her coming out party because what she's been able to do here in the NCAA tournament is nothing short of outstanding. When Vouts got hurt, Jayla Torrance takes over at the circle. What a start for number 21 in white. She had not pitched in back-to-back -back days since March 11th and 12th. They would not be here without Jayla Torrance. And the Crimson Tide will ride this season's wave all the way to the World Series. Jayla has been a rock star. Jayla Torrance is as strong as they come on the mound. She keeps coming back for more, and that's what I love about her. She has fire, she has a calming presence, and just to watch her is just watching my little sister grow up. When Montana went down, it was scary. It was probably the toughest week in the coaching that I've ever gone through. And Jayla basically said, give me the ball, and I'm gonna do this. And she put the entire team on her shoulders. People wrote off the Crimson Tide when Montana Bouts got injured in the SEC tournament. But the reason the Tide are playing in this game today is because of Jayla Torrance. To be able to step in and help our team get here, it's just a blessing to be able to experience this with my team. She pitched the most she had all year in those two weekends. It's like she had a second, third, fourth year in her that nobody knew about. She actually got better as she pitched. The theme of Alabama is where legends are made and one of them for sure is Jayla Torrance. She, she became a legend with those performances. Looks like Montana Fouts gonna enter the game right here for Jayla Torrance. I think Coach Murphy likes the idea of going with Torrance to start and having Fouts potentially come in to finish the name, the face of this Alabama program, getting an opportunity to close out this game. When I injured my knee, I immediately just wanted to be back out there on the field with my teammates, and I knew that I would do whatever it took to be back on the field with them. Montana's been there for me throughout these two weeks and just talked through pitches, batters, and I really appreciate her. Montana is probably the most resilient, hardworking pitcher we've ever had in our program. I can't say enough good things about her. My goal each season is just to be somebody that the other girls can look to in any scenario and just be there for them. I always know Montana's gonna give her whole heart to our team and just bring so much fire on the mound every time she's out there. Physically, I feel like a million bucks. I'm just happy to be here playing softball for another week. Making it back to the Women's College World Series means everything to me, but coming here, I'm just really lucky to have the uniform on, and I've said it before, but win, lose, or draw, I've already won.